And so his dad just scooped him up and started walking out the church. And as he's at the narthex, he turns around and looks at the congregation and says, pray for me, pray for me. Because <laughs> <laughs> she waits right till it gets quiet. And then, <laughs> then she talks to everybody that's around her. So you, <laughs> you know what? They're God's children. So uh, that's what my attitude with people can be doing. Look, my kids were making noise in church. I was like, well, I don't here. think so. Yeah. Thank you, girl. Is Daddy, are you sleeping? I love you. Let me see. Mm. Hey, my baby. Let me see. The daddy. The Ready daddy. Jessica. <laughs> Hi, Jessica. I need to get her hair fixed. Hi, Jessica. Hi, Jessica. Hi, Jessica. Hi, little giggy girl. Can you stand right there when I fix her hair? Yeah. Yeah, little Jessica. Little, little Jessica. Hi, little Jessica. Give me a smile, little Jessica. Give me, give me, give me, give me, give me. Give me, give me, give me smiles. Turn the TV on. I want to... Can we just get a little hair? Can mommy get your hair? Ashley's asleep. Do you really do, Mary? Finally, did you have to get some stuff done? What? We really do gotta get some stuff done. Heck yeah. We gotta they get that room fixed they up. They said if she goes home on a trial basis with us yeah. for that day and she does good, yeah. they're gonna release her the following week. Yeah. I might go ahead and put my vacation in just to this day. Because I'm gonna take two weeks. Well, Jessica. Jessica. Hi Jessica. Hi Jessica. Hi Jessica. Hi Jessica. Hi Jessica. Hi Jessica. You see? <laughs> oh yeah.
Hey, did you get a new camera bag, Chuck? Yeah. Got a bigger one? Did you see Eric's camera? No, I didn't. He got a new camera. Mom said he got one though, huh? Yeah. Good. I'm sure Jill finally laid he down the He was taking lock. pictures last week here. I'm sure Jill finally laid down the lock. You got a big new TV too. Oh, I'm glad you're here, guy, because you can help me after the sun goes down. I got to move. Carla and I are going to go out and buy a new TV and a bed tomorrow for that other room over there. We're going to make that other room functional. Well, come over and help me move move a... How you doing? Girl, Ashley, are you being good girl? Are you being good girl? Look at her smile. Did she smile? I got her to smile. For me too. Looks a lot better. I get you go. Next Sunday they school probably. I get you go. I get you go. Get you go. Hi, baby. Actually. You want me to see if we can take you out? No, we'll take you out. Yes, she's smiling. Girl. When she's smiling. Yes, silly thing on there. What's your silly thing doing on there? Yes, You're gonna girl. get rid of that, Jessica. Yes. <laughs> oh yeah. Don't this is just no. This hey, is just Jessica. Put it back or you can put clear. No, this is just for humidity. Oh. Just for humidity. Oh. It's not okay. making her breathe. No, it's not doing anything for her. Just, para que no se just to keep it moist. Hey, Jessica. Just to keep it moist. Did you bring the strollers, Mom? Yeah. Let me go see if she's gonna. Will we let her out? Is it nice with me? Nice enough for her? Yeah, it's really nice. Let me just go see if she's gonna. You guys might get warmer up. She might you feel warm with that. <laughs> <laughs> We're gonna have her pick feet. Can we put them a little bit? Put her hands up so high. What does this do? What does this do? Ashley. Yeah. Ashley. What are you doing, Ashley? Baby doll. You sit here with Grandpa. Put the cat The Chinese waitress came and took her. Oh, she did over there to the kitchen. Into the kitchen. She didn't worry about it because she took her. I wouldn't have trusted her. What if she goes out the back door? Yeah. Don't be might have gone that. to China. Don't be doing that. No, she took her to the kitchen. I think. And Pero que si se salen por atrás. Es lo que le dije a la mejor. Ah. Look at your uncle Charlie over there. Look at your uncle over there. Look at. Jessica. 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 Who is? Ashley. Huh? Ashley. Jessica. Well, we can let her sit there for a minute until she. Yeah, until she fusses. Oh wait. Martita, say cheese. I was gonna get her out. Cheese. You gonna take her say out cheeseburger. Yeah. You wanna sit there? We wanna put her. Her? You wanna get her out? We need to put her.
Over there? Yes, maybe. There's another chair up there. Sorry. Get one more big one, Chuck. I can fit can you? my... Yeah, you know, for Martha, though. I can fit my tiny little tushy in here. I don't think. But for Martha. Well, mine is just barely <laughs> got in there. <laughs> what a coin is getting some. Isn't that something? Okay. Is there more big ones over there? I think there's one more over there. Look at your, look at your, your mom. What are you doing? Hmm? Not sure. There we go. There we go. She okay? Yeah. <laughs> She's all. Does that hurt your eyes? Did that hurt you? She'll get used to it. Mm -hmm. George, what is it? Poor chuckle though. You have to get another chair. Get a rocker. Bring that whole bench. Get into it too. There's a waiting list. Is it right on there? It's not? It's the same as the Kennedy with Lincoln letter. You ever see that one? Yeah, Kennedy and Lincoln. Yeah, I forgot it. Coincidences? Coincidences. The assassination of Kennedy. Very similar to the assassination of Lincoln. <laughs> Is that true, Martita? I haven't read it. Oh, okay. There you go, Martha. Where's a better one, Martha? It rocks. Oh, come <laughs> <laughs> on. She ended up getting the best one. Yeah, well, that's patient. How See? about you, Charles? You think you're going to feed him the little one? No, mijito, you're going to wreck it. It's a good fruit. It's a good fruit. Hey! Get up and it'll be stuck on your butt. But you're going to take it home. I dare you to stick with it. <laughs> you're going to take it home with you. Yeah. How's your chair? Is it comfortable enough? <laughs> the one he carried Ashley. over here? What do you do? Hey, what? Look at her. What are you doing? Ashley. It was good to be in church today, huh, Mom? Ashley. 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 Yeah. Where's Jessica? They'll all be. Oh, come on. What I don't understand is why the Crystal Cathedral has got its gates. I know. Long. I think it thinks it's a terrorist is gonna. I never seen that. What? What do you want? You want to make one thing turned over this way? Yes. Yeah. The gate is actually. Ashley. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Come on. Grandpa. Whoa. Grandpa Ashley. Come here, Ashley. Grandpa, Grandpa, Grandpa. Chuck, did you get one of those long lasting batteries? She doesn't want to. She doesn't like me anymore. She's playing right now. Yeah, that's, she plays and she does that. Yeah, she plays. Does she ever do that to you, George? Yeah, all the time. Me too. No, she's never played. Uh huh. When he's holding her, if I, oh, if I do that, she'll, she'll joke oh, they, and she'll like that. yeah, and she laughs. It's a game to them. Yeah, she does that. Actually, actually. Nice out here, huh, mom? Yeah. Money's not the type. Oh no, I'm just kidding. I'm gonna make a picture, Mark, then send it to Champ. Because okay, she can see you holding me. Jessica. Oh, you're holding Jessica. <laughs> see? Can you get Ashley over there? Yeah. Ashley, they got a good Wave to champ, Martha. Wave, yeah. <laughs> good. <laughs> okay. Okay. Ma, wave to champ. I'm going to send him a picture. Hi, Mijo. Okay. Dying to see you. Okay. Look at Jessica. And hey, look Jessica. at Ashley over here. Dunkity dingy 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 ding
smiling. Jessica smiling. Jessica smiling. No, she's not in a very good mood. Who, Ashley? She's chewing away on that. Her teeth. She's, uh, she's even on the back part of her. Ashley, don't, 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 Ashley. 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 Oh, yeah. She turns that away as soon as she hears it. repeated enough. The nurse was telling me that I guess the top ones are harder for them to come in. <laughs> the Chinese food was good. What did you guys have? Same old, same old? What was the best thing about it, Dad, other than the price for you? <laughs> the what? That's why it was so good. <laughs> <laughs> it didn't cost me anything. Huh? But she goes. That's her breathing. She's okay. As long as her, it's actually pretty good. It's 122, I think. I'm going to take a picture of that and send it out. What's your, Carla, you can hear it more with her because it got open. Yeah. Carla, what's your respiratory? Um, we don't have respiratory. Yeah, you do, right? No, oh, you're right. You're right. We don't. She's okay. Ashley, 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 what are you doing? What are you doing? Roll them in, roll them in. The morning of the. <laughs> Only had enough of them last time. You're rolling, man. 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 You're Baby cake as best as you can. Well, what he should concentrate on is get a, get a, get a good medical recovery. I've got a wife. I was like, a little too close. I mean, she didn't go that direction. You need insurance, otherwise. Dingy dang 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 dang. Dingy dang 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 dang. What are you doing, Chuck? Same thing you are. Okay. Yes. Sunday, September 20 something. It's the 22nd. 23rd. And this is the first time that Jessica's been home for about five and a half months, I think. Mm hmm. Huh? Yeah. And there's Jessica. Ashley's over at mom's. Jessica. Hello, little girl. <laughs> Jessica. And we're glad she's home. Waiting for Ashley to come back over. Ashley's asleep. There's the room. Carla's got it all cleaned and ready. We drink a lot of water around here. Always in the bathroom. But we're glad Jessica's home. And we knew she'd come home. We thank everybody for all their prayers. Thank our family. Thank God. Thank our friends at church. Thank our friends everywhere. Thank Carla's family and mom and sisters for all their prayers. And this is the little miracle child. Seven operations. Eight. A couple of major heart surgeries. And she's home. Hi, Jessica. Jessica. Hi, Jessica. We're getting her other room fixed up. There's a neighbor. Oh, they put a flag up. Look at our neighbors put a flag up. They did? In their window. Yeah, look. <laughs> They're the ones they don't And matter. I think they're Arab, too, they aren't are. they? Aren't they Arabs? And they keep their doors shut. Carla had an interesting uh, experience at 7-Eleven this morning. She had to set some Japanese girls <laughs> straight because they were giving the Arab guy a bad time. They, they were really rude, huh, Carla? Yeah, and they couldn't speak English. Huh? And the Japanese girls couldn't speak English. Very well. And they were being mean to the Arab yeah. guy that works there. So Carla finally said, made him cry, I think. 
Because <laughs> she told them that they're the meanest people she's ever seen. I tell them to go back to where they came from. Normally Carla's pretty nice, but... Yeah, but they were being very Even mean. she has a... Hi, Jessica. Yeah. Hi, Jessica. He's so, He's it's Sunday. Baby. We'll probably be hanging out home pretty much the whole, whole day. day. <laughs> We're at least not having to go back and forth today. And Jessica hasn't been home in five and a half months. So, we, and then we take her back at the end of today. It's kind of a trial run. Get ready for her to come back, hopefully, home for good on Wednesday. Mm -hmm. Dr. Winkleman Thanks stopped by with his family. George, you're getting it. <laughs> Jessica. Ashley's over my mom sleeping. We're just waiting for her to wake up. So we can all be together today. Hi, Jessica. Jessica. Jessica, what are you doing? And <laughs> house looks pretty good, Carla. Got a new fixing this room up here. Got a new TV. I put that stand together, I'll have you know. Even the glass hinges. People say I don't know how to do stuff, but they're sick. Sick in the head. Carla got a new beanbag chair. Gonna get rid of this. Uh oh, what do I hear? <laughs> There's Jessica. There's Jessica. Hi, Jessica. Let's see if she likes the beanbag. I think she might like the bean bag. Your sister likes the bean bag. Ashley likes the bean bag. You think you like the bean bag? It's a big room. It's good to have a big room, huh? <gasps> Look at Jessica in the bean bag. When your family comes out, they can use that new bed we're going to get because it'll fold out. Julian can just sleep on the bean bag here. <laughs> <laughs> Julian could use that for a pillow. He's talking about your Uncle Julian. Yes, he is. He's talking about Uncle Julian. This pretty comfy? Jessica! Is this pretty Jessica! Comfy? Jessica! Jessica! Boo boo. Shut Fred. up, Fred. Hey. Shut up. Don't. They're good. They like the girls. The neighbor actually said hi. Did you see it? Oh, he did? Yeah. He put a flag on his thing, too. <laughs> Everybody's got flags. Somebody's got a flag. Fred. Fred. He's wanting to talk to you. Freddy's wanting to talk to your daddy. Freddy's wanting to so talk to So I'm going to take down that crib. Yeah, this one. Today. We're going to move that one. We're going to move that one and then I'll take this out to the garage. <coughs> Everything will go out to the garage actually. <laughs> well, anything else, Carla? No. That's it? That's about it. Oh, you don't get in? Let's see what's on ESPN Sports Classic. Got my new TV here. I got him hooked. Got him hooked up. Cable. But day one of the '97 Ryder Cup dawned with a drenching rainstorm that oh, produced a 90-minute delay. It was the first I didn't buy this for and the worst storm in eight years. Look, Nerves that were already on edge Jessica. <laughs> Jessica. <laughs> Jessica. What are you doing, Jessica? <laughs> what are you doing, Jessica? <laughs> Ashley, what are you doing? <laughs> Who's that? Your daddy. Jessica? Your daddy. Jessica. Jessica, Jessica, hi Jessica. What are you doing, Jessica? <laughs> what are you doing, little girl? So am I, what are you doing, Ashley? Soak it up. Ashley, you be nice. You be nice. She's been really nice. Has she been nice? Yes. Has she been nice? Has she good, Ashley, with her sister? Mm -hmm. Little Giggiga. Giggiga! Mm -hmm. What's my mom doing? Nothing. Giving her your toy. 
Aww, thank you. That nice you. girl. Good nice girl, Ashley. <laughs> that a nice little gooey girl. <laughs> Jessica's even smiling. <laughs> Hi, Jessica. Hi, Jessica. <laughs> Jessica. Hi, Ashley. Hi, Ashley. <laughs> and Ashley, don't touch that, Ashley. <laughs> Why do you gotta touch it? Hey, why going? do you gotta giddy, touch giddy, giddy, everything? Giddy, giddy. You got your hands everywhere. Jessica, tell her to quit touching e stuff. Jessica. <coughs> Aww. Ashley, <laughs> don't throw it in her face like that. You're trying to give it to her, aren't you? Hi, Jessica. you just trying to show it to her? Here. Look, there's poo. Scared poo. 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 Hot, huh? Yeah, hot, hot today. today. See how the room looks. We finally took down the crib. That's where the new bed's gonna go over there. Right in there, there's the new telly with digital VCR. Got a rocker. There's Jessica's crib. Lamp. Nice lot of room, see? A lot of room here. Got a chair. Fan. Thirsty, man. Thirsty. Great something to drink. Get my sobe. Sobe drink. There it is. Carrot. Carrot and orange juice, I think. Is that what this is? Oh, those are the new sunglasses I bought. Orange carrot. Yeah. That's <sighs> good. It's good, man. It's hot. See if Carla wants to drink of this. She might want to drink of this. Carly, you want to drink of my Sobe? Carla, you want to drink of my Sobe? You haven't had Sobe? Alexa? No. It's orange juice with carrot juice. Well, I have to keep her. I will in just a minute. Let what? me try it. Ashley. What are you watching? Nothing really. Look at Jessica's standing What's this bottle for? A bottle. Is that Jessica's bottle? She didn't eat it. She keeps staring. You see her staring at Ashley? Jessica. Jessica. What are you doing, little Jessica? Ashley. <laughs> Be nice, Ashley. Be nice. She's being really nice. She's feeding. Mm -hmm. Well, Jessica likes to eat. Well, this is September 20, what, Carla? Six? And this is Jessica's first night home for good, permanent, in Ashley, <laughs> in about almost six months, huh? And there she is. She's had about seven or eight operations. And Ashley's down here. 
messing around and uh, uh, Ashley you're gonna watch this someday it's just a couple of weeks after the horrible tragedy in New York that you'll probably read about in your textbooks Ashley you'll study about that and you'll read about it many years from now and it was just a horrible time but we do celebrate today because your sister's home she's been in the hospital Ashley for since what April Carla the 12th. there's your mommy over there taking care of her and you're over here running around like crazy you're hard to keep up with. Hey, where are you going? Where are you going? <laughs> Ashley, watch how you like to look at me and then run. Where are you going? Where are you going, Ashley? Get over here. Get over here. Hey, get over here. Get over here, Ashley. But you know, Ashley, you're probably with, of course, God got us through it all, but we want you to know, little girl, that you, you, you got us through it all too because even though we were at the hospital and there were tough times we knew we were always coming home to you little girl and we love you and everybody loves you and everybody loves Jessica too but you were our strength little girl you're very special want to go see your sister Jessica Where's Jessica, Ashley? Where's Jessica? Where's Jessica? Let's go see Jessica. Come on. Come on. Come on. Let's go see Jessica. Hi, Jessica. Hi, Je Ashley, there's only one... There's only one baby as cute as you, Ashley. Maybe even cuter. And that's this one right there. Hi, Jessica. <laughs> and Jessica, everybody cried. At the hospital, they were sad to see you go. Huh? What's she doing over there? She's just playing with her diaper. At Jessica. Jessica. <laughs> Hi, Jessica. And so, she's home. She's home, she's home. Ashley, you're a tough one to watch. Boo boo, boo boo, boo boo. Okay, I'm gonna stop taking video here. Anyway, the world is still recovering. We're gonna go to war, Ashley. It's uh, everybody's scared about terrorists and nerve get. Did you hear that they evacuated uh, over in L.A. right now, Carla? They're evacuating. Um, the subway stations or the train yeah, stations? I just heard that of a, so people were getting sick or yeah, some fume or something. Some fumes, some yeah, they don't know what it is. They don't know what it is. See girls, it's a the world's a very unstable place right now, but we're Christians and we put all our faith in Christ. We're Protestants because we uphold the Bible and the Bible alone. Ashley, and we're Seventh-day Adventists because we believe, do believe, I do anyway, that the church has been blessed with some great last day truths, including the fact that we're in the judgment hour and also the truth on the fourth commandment and even on the state of the dead. And uh, we're going to let you make your own minds as to what you want to be, but we are going to have worship we're going to go to church on the Sabbath. We're going to do our best to obey God. And I want you to know that Jesus loves you. He created you and He died for you, Ashley. And He loves you. And He loves Jessica. And we love Jessica. Little Jessica. Okay. There's the doorbell. I think that's Ash, uh, Jessica's... Ashley, I think Jessica's... Uh, feeding thing is here, okay? Okay. There goes mommy to get the feeding tube. Ashley, Ashley, stay here little girl. She's going to get something for the door. 
no, 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 watch out, Ashley, Ashley, move, Ashley, move, good girl, good girl, good girl, Hey there, Ashley. Somebody down there getting equipment for us. Uh, okay. Ashley, what are you doing? We're going to use the pump. You're going to need bags, right? For the pump. Uh, they actually gave, I'm going to need bags. They gave me one just in case I need one. Oh, just one bag. Hmm. Because it's, it's not in here. That's Ashley. Right. They're okay, getting some equipment for your sister, Ashley. They said that we need some bags to put her food in when they feed her. We pour the formula in the bags and it goes in inside her feeding tube. But we don't have any bags, we only have one, so a nice man's checking his truck to see if there's any, okay? Okay, mm -hmm. he is. All right. Is that Billy Graham? Ashley, there's Billy Graham. Ashley, you won't remember him when you get old. <laughs> Ashley, I want you to remember this. It's just a couple of three weeks after that terrible tragedy, Ashley. Ashley, you're going to read about this in your history book someday. The world is never the same since it happened. And as you sit here and play with your toys, oblivious to the events that are going on in the world right now, we just want you to know that we love you and we love Jessica. She's asleep. There's your sister. She's home now, Ashley. And we're watching this a replay of this beautiful, beautiful memorial that was just a few days after the tragedy on September 11. And it's Sabbath and afternoon. And the tragedy was when the, air, the airlines went into the World we Trade Center. We want you to know right. that we are grateful that you have called And this your service. mom wanted me to remind you that the that tragedy, of course, was when those church. two jetliners went into the of many uh, New York buildings. To say to this nation, and to the world that those who lost their lives, innocent lives, unspeakable tragedy, and the violence that has been committed to this nation, that those of us who are gathered here, Muslim, Jew, Christian, Sikh, Buddhist, Hindu, all people of faith, want to say to this nation and to the world, that love is stronger than hate. And that love lived out in justice will in the end prevail. So we are grateful that you have come here this day. And we want you to know as you gather that this is indeed a house of prayer for all people. So we hope that you will let this be a container for your grief. But in addition to that, we want you to know that the light that burns here, the light of love, the light of justice, the light of hope, shines brighter than any light in the world. So come often, pray to God here, and let us be united that we will make that message of love, the message that the world needs to hear in this time of great tragedy. President Bush has asked that later in this service there will be an offering for those organizations and institutions that are reaching out to those lives who have been rent apart 
by this tragedy. So I'm not ashamed to say to you today, be generous in that because there are many who will need our care in the days ahead. Thank you, Mr. President, and welcome to all of you to the Cathedral Church of St. Peter and Paul, the National Cathedral, and most importantly, a house of prayer for all people. Did you hear that, Ashley? It's a house of prayer on this Sabbath afternoon. Is that lady going to sing? No? No, that's his... Um... Preacher? I think so. When ancient Israel <laughs> suffered the excruciating pain and tragedy of do? militant aggression oh, and destruction, God said to them through the prophet <laughs> Jeremiah, <laughs> Ashley, we oh, love you, Ashley. We love you so much. Lamenting we love you. Bitter weeping. Little girl. Rachel is weeping for her children. And she refuses to be comforted. Jessica. Little Jessica. See, Ashley, you already know Today Jessica. Today we Ashley. gather to be reassured that I got my two books in the mail today, too. Lamenting and bitter weeping of Mother America because so many of her children Ashley, I'm going to give this book to you someday and it's Let a good book there's another book for the healing of our grief-stricken hearts for the souls and sacred memory of those look Ashley That's beautiful, isn't it? Pretty, isn't it? Do you like that, Ashley? Did you like that? <laughs> <laughs> Pretty 
Where's your bean to go? Today is October 7th, Carla? Yes. And we had a good day today. Mm -hmm. uh, except that today was the day that we went to war. Mm -hmm. The first day of a new war, Ashley. We're fighting a new war today. It's, you know, I've been trying to keep you informed. There's Jessica. <laughs> Hi, little Jessica. Ashley, ever since the attack on September 11, 2001, on New York City and Washington, on the World Trade Center and the Pentagon, we knew that kind of this would, it would lead to this. And Ashley, today is the day that we started a war with another, I don't know, a country, I guess it is a country, Afghanistan. And uh, we started bombing today. It's a war against terrorism. It's not a war against any religion or any, uh, you know, uh, well, yeah, religion. It's, it's just against terrorists and terrorism. So what did we do today, Carla? Let's see. We had lunch. My dad came over and we had lunch. Martha and Mar Martita came over. We had some Italian food. Buca de Beppo. Martha made enchiladas. Martha made enchiladas. And rice. And rice. Let's see. Uh, I went to the gym. I ran four and a half miles today at LA Fitness. Your mommy was doing a lot of work with Jessica, giving her medication. A girl came over today, lady. A nurse. A nurse. And she, uh, what, filled, mixed them. Mixed some, Mix some medication medications for, for Jessica for shots. Because little Jessica still has to get some medication, Ashley. You're not going to remember any of this. I keep telling you that. That's why I'm <laughs> doing this. Because one day we'll be long gone unless the good Lord comes first. And we kind of think he will. But if we're not, you have something to remember your parents by. And when you were little. Because we'll be, we'll be old. You know, imagine when she's old enough to really comprehend this. Yeah. How much different things will be. <laughs> Who knows how this world will yeah. be. But anyway, Ashley and Jessica, we just want you to know that we love you, that your parents love you, and this is a just another historic day in the world because of America is at war. We're, we're, we're dropping bombs and sending missiles in the country of Afghanistan, and it started today on September 7, 2001. You're reaching <laughs> for the camera. No, Ashley. <laughs> No, we think you might have a little ear infection, Ashley. We're not sure. Maybe she has a toothache and it's making her ear. Maybe your teeth are cutting teeth or whatever. Because she seems to be a little bit better now. Every time you grab that, Ashley, you change it to something that <laughs> we don't want to see. <laughs> Ashley, what she do you have to? <laughs> she almost hit herself in the head with it. That would top it all off today. Yeah. Let's see, Ashley, you hit your head today on the hinge. I saw you, you knocked it against the hinge. Let's Your see. Foot got stuck. And then I didn't tell your mama this. No. First you hit your head on the hinge, then your foot got stuck. And we thought you hurt your busted your <laughs> ankle or something. And then I didn't tell your mama this, but when I took you for a walk, I picked up one of those things that fall off the tree, the like a honeycomb oh, or honeycomb. something. Is that what they are? Mm -hmm. And you were about to start putting it in your mouth and I was going to say, yeah, it doesn't matter, it's just a honey cone. And then this, these little girls came up and said, <laughs> this little girl goes, those have poison on them. And I have a friend that she ate poison blueberries and she died and her name was Ashley. Oh. So I pretty much grabbed it from you, Ashley, and threw it. I mean, it was just a day when, Everything. you know, what else could have gone wrong, you know, with, as far as you go, Ashley. But, just because he's nervous. There's a car going by out the alley. That's the alley out there, Ashley. Trash can. Truck parked out there. It's kind of dark. The alley's kind of dark at night, huh? Mm -hmm. Okay, Ashley and Giggiga. 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 <laughs> Look at Jessica. <laughs> She's looking at the camera. Hi, Jessica. He's smiling. Hi, Jessica. Happy to be at home. 
Hi Jessica. Hi Jessica. Ashley. <laughs> Ashley. Honey, that's we love you. Shoe. Are you gonna have popcorn? Yeah. Mama's gonna make popcorn. Okay. Bye. Bye. Dirty Steve. Okay, here's a picture of the crib. Ashley. Jessica's following you all the way around. Can't believe I'm taking a picture of a crib <laughs> when I could be taking a picture of Gigiga. Gigiga. Jessica. Hi, Jessica. Jessica. Ashley. Ashley. Ashley, what? Don't, don't untie my shoe, Ashley. Jessica. Hi, Jessica. Hi, Jessica. What are you doing? Jessica. Ashley, leave my shoes alone, will you? Ashley. Ashley. Ashley, leave my shoes alone, will you? Huh? Okay. But he's getting ready for church. There he is, right there. What are you doing? Hey. hey. Ashley. He's getting ready for church. Watch out, watch your step. Hmm. There's Carla. Get her in there. Come on, sweetie. Go on, I gotta iron my shirt. <laughs> I already ironed one shirt and found out it had a spot on it. Hi, Jessica. Oh, bless you. Bless you. Bless you. Bless you. Bless you. Just take it easy, huh? I gotta finish ironing my shirt. Are you gonna go to church today? Jessica, Jessica. Jessica, Jessica, what are you doing? I like this part right here. Jessica. Jessica. What are you doing? What are you doing? What are you doing? Stop moving around so much. You're not going to go in the chocomobile. There's mommy. There's mommy. It's going to bring the car around. Wave. Give mommy a wave. There's Nani's house. No, Ashley, no. 
Okay, you want my glasses? You want my glasses? As for you, I get heavy, man. Mommy's gonna bring the car around so we can go to church, okay? You wanna go to church? You wanna go to church? Huh, boo boo? No, boo boo, you're already reaching out. For, you already have my glasses. Comes mommy. You can go to church. Here's mommy. Open the garage? Yeah. Okay, we're ready to go. Close the garage. Gotta go get, what are we getting from my mom's? Shoes and car seat. Shoes and car seat? Huh? Is she out there? There's nannies. There's nannies. Over here. Look. Actually, here. Right here. There's nannies. Right here. Oh my gosh. <laughs> don't, George. You don't want to. Love that. Here, George. Mm, Queen, she's been in a good Jessica. mood. Yeah. You gotta get her shoes. Ashley. <laughs> Ashley. Look over here. Ashley. Ashley. What are you hiding for, Ma? You got your hair done. <laughs> All right. <laughs> the face is Ashley. Ashley. What's that tape on your hair? Keep my hair from going all over the place. Where's Priscilla? I don't know. I don't know. Are you okay, Mom? The meteorologist Tom Dunkley coming to us from the KMX Weather Center. Plenty of sunshine around the base of the day, but we will see lots of high clouds as well. That's due to a very it's weak... It's a new wide open interchange here. It cools down much with highs in the mid to upper 70s today. Lows tonight. Five. It's that wide open, five, how many lanes? Six, going to church, Sabbath morning, the girls are back there, and uh, whoa, whoa, oh man. I don't care what people say. And we're just headed to church on the 5. And we'll be uh, church probably at about, I'd say a quarter of, something like that. Okie dokie then. Here's that big interchange, the 91 and the 5. Well, not that big. But, uh, Check out for now. Check out for now, Carla. Yeah. Or keep filming. What do you want to do? All right. Okay, we're just about at church, Carla. On uh, Doherty Road here. Arcadia Library over there. Uh, we're just about gonna head over to church. In the church. Where the girls are still asleep? Yeah. There's some apartments over there. Here's the Arcadia Library. Pull in here pretty soon. Phil will be out there, I'm sure. Looks like somebody's getting a ticket up here, Carla. Uh -oh. This thing is not us. Where? Oh, well, something's going on here. Oh, well, nobody's getting a ticket. Oh.
Here we are at church. Feels good. There's Eric and Jill. Beautiful day. In the neighborhood. How's she doing? Good, yeah. Gotta get Ashley out, though. Do you want me to hold Jessica? Get in for Doesn't make any difference. One. Did I drop some? What do you have to say on Thanksgiving, Dad? Thank God, thank the water and power. <laughs> In that order. In that order? Yeah. What do you have to say for Thanksgiving? I have to say we have much to be thankful for today here in this we do. country of yours. Yeah. And I feel, feel, feel sorry for a lot of people in the world. Most of the people don't have the benefits we have here. A lot to be thank thankful for. Thank a lot of times I think about that, I, I, get, I get emotional. I lose it, man. I can't believe it. About what? About all those people dying and suffering like they are. All over the world. Why does... One of the reasons... I can't understand... I hate to question it, but why does God permit all the suffering? You can't ask yourself that. Because that, that conscious of doubt... Yeah. You don't, want to, you don't want to entertain that because we don't know why. Maybe those are bad people. No, little kids are not bad people. It's yeah. just that it's a sin. The world is in rebellion. And that's a side effect. Yeah, it's, think, it's sin. I think, I think God is just as sorry as we are. Maybe more. Yeah. More. Yeah, because he said he grieved. He ever made man during Noah's day, remember? He said God grieved. He grieved in his heart. Yeah. That he made man. I cry about, about that just about every day. Well, the sad part is to think of the people that are going through such pain. You know, the loss. I'll tell you, if you go to... The children in Africa, the faces full of flies. Yeah. The big belly. Chil they babies. Hungry is. babies. You don't even have to go to Africa. You go to TJ. Yeah, right. You don't have to go far. A hundred miles away. Yeah. TJ. Or down to or, or down in some the, areas maybe, of... Maybe even in our country. Yeah. In places in the Appalachians, <laughs> in the bio. Yeah. 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 You know what? And you know, uh, Christ said you're always going to have poor. Remember that? Yeah. Christ said you're always going to have poor. Yeah, he said that. Yeah. He said that when uh, when they were doing Judas this complained. Yeah, they were, they were, what did he say? They were anointing his hair. Yeah. Martita. 
Remember, remember she was putting all on his hair? Say hi. Hi. She was wasting money. Yep. Matthew. Yeah, Judas got all mad because they wasted money. Yeah. The, uh, and, and, and he was stealing money. What chairs go Yeah, he was yeah, just a big your chairs, right? fraud. No, the, the brown ones. Oh, the brown ones? Where's the other brown ones? Mary, oh, Mary, uh, I don't think it was Mary Magdalene. Oh, wasn't Mary Magdalene George? Yeah, the poor, the alabaster. She spent all kinds of money on the perfume. She was anointed before his crucifixion. Right. A couple more dad's chairs and putting this one over in the middle of hers. And one of the disciples complained, Judas. Yeah. So we could have paid that to, we could have given you that money to the poor. Why are you wasting it? Yeah. You need chairs to sit on you guys. Did you get my sherry in there? Yeah, I'm going to. I'm going to get, you mind if I get a little bit of Martha? No. And Phil? Phil, what do you have to say thankful for? For being with everybody this year for Thanksgiving. Yeah. And that it turned out real good. Was the food good? Very, very good. Okay. All right. Good, huh, Priscilla? Martha's all right. Yeah. The best in the West. <laughs> Martha, your vegetables were delicious. Yeah. And your yams. She can cook up a storm. Sherry, you're on camera now, so watch what you say. Be careful. Oh, there's Alex in the dark. <laughs> she runs. It's definitely fall, isn't it? The leaves. <laughs> I think I need to do what Alex is doing to work work off that gravy. <laughs> is Julian gonna have a piece of pie, Sherry? Uh, what do you want to say to the camera, uh, Alex? What do you have to be thankful for? Jorge. What do you say you're thankful for? Jorge. Huh? No, come on, be serious. What are you thankful for? Your mommy and daddy? Do you, do you think? What are you thankful for? <coughs> for food. You, for health? Food. Yeah, food, that's good. And to have a cousin. Oh. A lot. <laughs> And you're thankful you have your mommy and daddy? Yes. Yes. <laughs> you're okay sometimes, aren't you? All right. All right. I want a piece of pie, please. And you're thankful for a piece of pie. That's what I say. Pumpkin cake. Pumpkin cake? Oh, pumpkin cake. Priscilla, you're ready for that cake, huh? Look at that. Serve it up, man. That's the next thing. That's <laughs> Serve it up. He wants turkey number two. Carla, what do you have to be thankful for besides me? For God and then my family. Yeah, and then what? Yeah, okay. That's good. <laughs> Martha, what do you have to be thankful for? I for everything, just for being here, for being alive. Oh, that's good outlook. Good attitude. Diana, you agree with that? Really? And you have beautiful Sarah. Yeah, what a blessing. We have everything. Yeah, boy. We are blessed. More than what we deserve. Especially when you see, you know, what's going on in the world and. Mom, you have to be thankful for staying up all night and working and... My cup overflows with blessings. Yeah. My sons, my grandchildren, my daughter, my sister. In-laws and... Martha's a beautiful person that's always here to help me in yeah. the kitchen. And, uh... Whoops, whoops, whoops. God looked out for you, didn't he? Yes, he did. And he continues to... He always has. Yeah. And he's the one that I depend on. He's faithful. Yes. Amen. So Even when we're not, he's faithful. Even when we're not, he's faithful. 
Right. Chuck, what do you have to be thankful for on this November 22nd? <laughs> Chuck? Well, where do I start? Um, First and foremost, I'm thankful that we could all be together as a family this year. Yeah. And I think that's a great thing, and I think that's made it special. Yeah. And I'm thankful that uh, because Jesus is in this family, that uh, I was talking about this with a customer just yesterday. Yeah. Telling them that my mom and my dad and, and my dad's wife, we were all going to have meals together, and the yeah. world can't understand that. Yeah, right. And uh, they just thought it was so great. Yeah. And I'm thankful for uh, the kids that have been brought into this family uh, recently. Yeah. Uh, you know, their blessings, uh, all of them. And we're looking forward to them growing up together. And and being uh, friends and Amen. loving them and seeing them grow and seeing what uh, God's going to teach us through their lives. Amen. And I'm thankful for, uh, for my father and my mother and my brothers and your wife, visitors and my wife and my family. You got a pretty good wife there? Uh -huh. <laughs> what can I say? You ready yeah. to say yes, yeah, George? I, say? I don't know how you snagged that, but you got pretty lucky. Yeah, I did. You're pretty lucky. You're beautiful woman. Yeah. You're beautiful woman. Like that? Amen. I am lucky. I can't explain it. That's a blessing from above. Yeah. Amen. And I'm thankful for you. Yeah. All right. Thank you for you. That's good. <laughs> All right. Sounded pretty good. And Jessica. The chance to give his one big reason to be thankful. Yeah, that's right. A miracle baby. Yeah. A miracle baby. The miracle baby. Give you a miracle baby. Give you a miracle baby. Give you a miracle baby. He was good while everybody ate. He didn't bother. Mike, any bottle of water? Yes. You want it for her? Yeah. They're in the back of the car. Sit down, Julian. <laughs> Sit down. I hear you smiling. She's laughing. I want to hold her. I love you. Are we pretty well done here? Are these drying or are they dry? No, they're not. These are drying. Hey, Martha, I forgot to ask you, what are you thankful for? Mm. And be specific, please. For the whole family? Oh, okay. And you have a whole big other family in Mexico, huh? Yeah. You thankful for them? Uh huh. Your cousin uh, April? Yeah. And who else? Uh, Claudia? Yeah, everybody. Everybody back there, huh? Do they celebrate Thanksgiving? Not really in Mexico, on my huh? No. It's not a holiday. They work today, huh? Yeah. Yeah. Still open up those chairs and put them right there so people can sit. Cool Whip. What happened to the Ready Whip? No, oh, that's Cool Whip. No, you're, but those are, that's, that's for the you don't use uh, You don't use Ready Whip on that? No, it's too rich. I made yours. Oh, you yours did? With Ready Whip? Yeah. No, I make homemade whipping cream. Oh, good. That's even better. Yeah, why would it homemade? <laughs> 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 I tried to film that. <laughs> 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 Did you see me? Don't wash the dishes, Martha. Martha. Sit down. Relax. Oh, my. Who did that? Take it easy. Oh. No me sit. You made me finish. I think Martha tries to give her, she tries to give everyone a guilt complex, Ma. Oh. Martha. Why? 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 She washing Guess dishes. Guess what? She doesn't give me one. <laughs> <Well>. <laughs> I'm sorry. Guess what? You really make her feel good. <laughs> <laughs> she works too much. You didn't bend over. I mean, no, I didn't. <laughs> Where's my little girl? I haven't seen her walk like she's supposed to walk. Who, Sarah? Little Sarah. Oh, she's been walking around the house all day. Hi, huh, Sarah. Sarah. Walking, walking, walking. I still have to put 30 years in there. There's the big sales tomorrow. I heard something about frogs. They came out of the mouth of the dragon. Oh, goodness. That's from Daddy, and that one's from me. Disneyland had them. Alex bought those at uh, Disneyland for us? Yeah, not us. They said I mean, for uh, there. They bought for Ashley and Jessica. Look, like, Pooh's dressed up oh, like Santa Winnie the Winnie the Santa Claus. And it's for then me. we got Tigger dressed up like a reindeer. 
Thank you. Wow. <laughs> Isn't that cute? And look. Julian almost get, had to push some lady at the parade because she was being rude. Yeah. <laughs> That's your mom. Oh, Oh, how cute. Alex, tell us about Disneyland. Alex, tell us what you went on. Alex, did you just get back from Disneyland? Wow, what was that? <laughs> candy? Is that candy? Be careful, you're stepping on stuff. Alex. <laughs> Tell, Tell, Tell me what you want. Did you see Mickey Mouse? Tell him about it. So then, you know what? We can show Jessica and Ashley one day. Yeah. She's going to wear that camera. I'm getting some close ups of you, Julie. <laughs> you're telling him about it. Tell us about what. About, oh, what's that? Look at that. Who's that for Taylor? This one's mine. Oh. Who is this over there? Did you watch the parade? Ooh, who's that for? Is that for you? Yes. Yes, sir. Yes, what was sir. The, the funnest ride that you went on? Uh, teacups. Oh, the teacups? <laughs> did you go fast? Who turned the wheel? Your dad did? No, my dad. <laughs> well, the bus. So what did else? you get this? That place where we are eating Carl's. Oh, <laughs> my favorite things at Carl's. Carl's, store. Carl's Jr. <laughs> <laughs> all of these Mickey and Minnie. Mama. 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 Still think you should have taken her on Pirates of the Caribbean. Mama. Did you go Mama. on that? Mama. No. The line was about two and a half hours, three hours long. Were the, all the lines long? Oh, did you go on Haunted Mansion? Yeah. Oh, don't oh. cry. <laughs> Mama. What, did, what did you ride? The people that were going oh, in look haunted. Look what it was. Oh, they did. Jessica gave, got this for you to you put in your room. It. Look what their picture made today for you. That's for you, uh, Alex. That's for you to put in your room. Isn't that nice? For you to sit up. Yeah. Thank you. Daddy. You're welcome. Daddy. Yeah. Look at their picture. We yeah, got one. pictures. One of them. You have to turn it upside down. I guess I'm kidding. Never mind. Isn't that cute? Mm -hmm. I got you one, one for your wallet. We got pictures Mom, to one take back. Mom, watch. Nope. That's from Carl Jr.? It goes in circles. <laughs> Isn't That's that cute. pretty? Mm -hmm. We can set that. It'll match your room, won't it? Sounded like she had pretty, a lot of fun over there. If you ask me. <laughs> Alex is getting your suckers. So, what made y'all want to walk all the way home? <laughs> she wanted a cheaper. He's going to wear that camera. Too. <laughs> 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 you wanted a cheeseburger? I've been walking all day. George, She's did you not see, in the mood. Did you see as you were interviewing your dad last what? night? When you were interviewing your dad last night yeah. through the window, did you see Julian hanging out? Like I saw that. <laughs> I did that on purpose. You can see it on the video. <laughs> Check it out. We're laughing about that. We were good. That coat. Mm -hmm. George. He's going to wear that. <laughs> <laughs> you'll see a struggle going on. I know, I'll like see, see this. <laughs> George, go down. Yeah. Somebody calling you? No, uh, it's him. Who? Yeah, probably. Oh, oh you're you just left now the, getting You left the message here. Yes, I did. No, it's been going off. He's going to come back with power. And he's going to come back with great glory. It is going to be awesome power. It is going to be power that is going to fill the heavens. No. Ashley, what are you doing? She's kidding. 
Ashley. What are you doing? Your hair's coming down. Ashley, what are you doing? What are you doing, Ashley? Sat down in the front row and listened to the shining face. The most positive man I've ever met. So glad to come to church. So glad to worship God. So what a privilege he'd say every time I preach he'd sit and cry because he loved the gospel. He was not part of the frozen chosen. He loved God. It was a formality. Bob Stone was going to come home. Dr. White, whom I baptized, an old Navy commander, was going to come home. A man who touched my life like few. HMS Richards and his son, whom I came to know very well. We became good friends. They're going to come home. Other people whom I grew to admire and love, Pastor and Mrs. Vanderman. I was cleaning out my desk for the first time in 10 years the other day. I felt this is at home, the second floor of our house. We don't have the third floor. The second floor of our house, I thought if I don't clean this out, it's going to go through the floor. Because of economic necessity, because I couldn't put a new floor, I cleaned out my desk. There was a letter from Elder Manuel, written 10 years ago. I read it through. Just before he died, he sent a message to me, and it was a beautiful message. When we ran the meetings at the Shrine Auditorium, I can remember it's coming down the front after one of those great meetings. And he put his arm around me. And as he prayed for me, Elder Bannerman was crying. A Christ like man. Those of you who watched him on television will know he was a prince among men. And also, Steve Wright, Nelly, beautiful person. Folks who used to come to our church when they could, who came with us to Russia some six times, Charles and Marion Alaska, they're going to come home one day. They're going to come home. Charles would fall asleep. His wife would be talking away. And she'd turn to him, or thought he was sleeping. Say, Daddy, do you remember? He would reel off all the facts and figures going back 30 and 40 years. Marion was in charge of our tours. Through her, we took hundreds of people to Russia. She made nothing out of it. She was rewarded only to the extent that she felt that she was serving God. One day, Marion and Charles are going to come home. As I was thinking about this last night, I thought of the last days I spent with my father. I drove up from Sydney to Brisbane. My father was about to go to hospital, for surgery. He was 83. My father had not always been a believer. While he came from what would be called a Christian home, he did not know Christ. came from a religious, pagan, Christian background, that's what it was, did not know the Bible. When I was taking the meeting, Harold, the camp meeting, North New South Wales, far everybody, my father came. When I made an appeal to accept Christ, that night I preached on Grace alone, faith alone. My hard-hearted old father stood up on the meeting. He was baptized. He was faithful to God. After he was baptized, we sat in the front lawn of our old home. Camp Hill, Brisbane, 94 Florence Street. He said to me, he was then on the pension. I don't know if you call it the pension here. 
your time with benefits. He said to me, tell me how to pay my tithe. He said, I want to do it proper. He said, I don't want to be like so many people. We just get baptized and means nothing to them. He said, tell me how to, how to work out my tithe. When he got too sick and couldn't go to church for several years, the deacons would come by every now and then and collect his tithe. His mother showed me his Bible. In the front of his Bible were the words, Jesus, help me do my best. I said to my dad before he went into surgery, before I went back to Sydney, this is son talking to his father. And now his son is the minister. How is it with your soul? He said, I'm all right. I'm trusting in God. My old dad, a prisoner, is going to come home. Yes, they're going to come home. The person who touched my life years ago was Pastor Bob Spangler. We had the seminary extension school at Avondale College, it seems, a million years ago. Almost once. 1966. Dr. Siegfried Horn taught. The other professors teach. Bob Spangler taught. Evangelist. I got to know him. It was through his invitation that I first went to Russia in 1991. He was killed driving from the media center down to LAX. Car rolled over and was thrown out. One day, Bob is going to come home. He's coming home. Bill May. Bill May was the president of the Texas Conference when I first went there in 1986. Bill was a straight shooter. <laughs> he uh, got a shock when he met another straight shooter. Bill wore a big Texas boots. He would work all night, all the next day, all through the next night, I'll go to bed. The next day, Bill couldn't stand lazy people. Bill had a passion for the lost. Bill died of cancer. Somewhat recently. We talked theology. We walked for miles. Argued for hours. Bill was saved. Bill's coming up. I know he is. B.J. Christensen was the president of this conference in Southern California. For a while, everybody knows that we had controversy with the BA. He didn't understand what we were doing and didn't like what we were doing. The feeling was somewhat mutual. In fact, he was the president and told me, it's time for me to go back to Australia. But I said, I bought a house here, and I like it here, so I don't think I'll go. <laughs> but BJ came with us across Russia on the Trans-Siberian Express. He came back again for a campaign. BJ died of cancer with his faith in Christ. BJ is going to come home. Okay, folks. Uh... We're coming down Cerritos, and uh, we're on uh, we're on the way over to uh, get this camera to the rightful owner. I got a pretty good hunch that uh, maybe the uh, nerves are getting a little frayed, and uh, maybe the uh, the uh, grace is wearing a little thin at this point. But uh, you know, I uh, I got home and. I, uh, you know, I had to take care of some things, you know, of a private nature, and you know, while you have an opportunity to do that, you you read the paper a little bit, and you know, then I had to, uh, of course, check the mail, 
and while I was at the house I had to undress and uh, then get dressed so uh, you know I'm, I'm probably not there right uh, when they would have uh, liked me to have been there but hopefully they can understand these things so uh, we're gonna sign off for now and we'll see you again uh, real soon folks okay and I wanted to take this opportunity to uh, express my gratitude uh, also for uh, providing this wonderful uh, publication here I've uh, been able to uh, start to go through some of it and uh, it's, uh, it's a great thing to have to my collection and uh, George uh, for this I, uh, I sincerely thank you Okay, we're walking into mom's and uh, let's see what kind of reception we're going to get Let's see if we get, uh, hey, nice to see you. Thanks for bringing the camera. We're glad you're here. Or let's see if we get something else. Let's just have a listen, folks, shall we? I think we shall. Let's see. Let's see, that's what it should be, but let's see what we get. She's got a Hello. Hey, Hi. Chuckster. Hey, what's up? Thanks for taking pictures for me, buddy. Cool. I finally gave my camera to him to finish Carter's sermon.